Here's a little tip for you. I've just got a back and seal bag. Made a big long one. I put celery, carrots, cabbage, turnip. I won't put onion in, but I'm going to back and seal it for when I, when I feel like a meal, but I don't feel like cooking. That I don't feel like chopping the things up, I mean, so they're ready. Now I've back and sealed all that. That's all ready. Turnip, carrot, cabbage, celery. I did put onion in the top. So no way I can get at that so that can stay in the fridge for a couple of weeks. If I want. Not that it'll last a couple of weeks in my house, it won't. But if you ever don't, I've got arthritis on my hands. If you ever can't be bothered, peel, it's always there. Grab it out, tip it in, put the meat in. Put the barley or the, the meat, uh, the ham, uh, the ham. Ham if you're doing pea soup. Um, chicken if you're doing barley soup. And beef if you're doing scouse. That'll do all of the, all three of them. That'll do all, and already back and sealed. Fabulous. I'm going to do a few more little bags while I've got the energy, while my hands are not too sore. I'm going to do that. So we hope you like that tip. So back and seal the machine. Get the, I only pay £15 off Amazon for mine. So get yourself one of them. Worth the weight in gold. Bye for now. Nanny Skelly 30. Subscribe. Press the button. Love you.